are Sprinklerinos, I hope you are well this Merry Monday. Today is going to be a Lush unboxing video. This beautiful box was sent to me by Lush, it came through my letterbox this week and I just thought I could, I could not not share this with you because I just think it's lovely and Lush gets me really excited. It's such a wonderful brand and the company has like such great ethics and they go to such trouble with all their products to make sure that they are ethically made and they smell beautiful and they look beautiful and they do a great job so I'm always really really happy to talk about those and also hello look at this packaging. So I've already opened the box and on top we have the little menu which I'll be using for reference and I will just dive right in and pick the first product. This is the Prince Charming shower gel and it is a lovely pinky red as you would expect, sit down there Mr Box, as you would expect um, from a Valentine's product and this product was made by Nikki because they have little stickers on and it says shower gel with marshmallow root. For root. Did not know that marshmallows were a plant is that a thing? Are they not sweets? Do they come from a thing like chocolate comes from cocoa beans? I'm gonna go with that, but um, I would like to Google what a marshmallow plant looks like. Fair trade vanilla and fresh pomegranate juice, Prince Charming will sweep you off your feet and carry you off into the sunset, leaving your skin silky soft and smelling lovely. Well, that's got my vote because I would very much like Prince Charming to sweep me off and take me into the sunset. Oh, to use, sweet and floral yet zingy and refreshing. Blah, 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 blah. Top tip, someday your prints will come. Better make sure you're looking your best. That's cute. This smells nice. Okay, that smells really sweet. It just smells like a packet of sweets and I like that. Ooh, look at the little bubble. Yeah, I like that. That is a nice product. I will be using that. Also, I love that it's in a little travel size because when I go away, I can take that rather than having to decant my big shower gel into a little travel sizey one. Okay, next up I'm going to go for this, which is a heart shaped soap. This is called Heart Throb, no it's not, this is called Cupid's Love Soap. Deliciously fruity soap filled with fresh figs and passion fruit juice. Ta-da! This one. Um, that smells fine. It smells fresh and it, I can smell the fig in it. I'm not really one for, f well I am one for fig smells I suppose. Mm, it's okay. Also, I don't really use soap bars. I use like liquid soap and shower gels and cleansers and stuff. So I don't ever pick up the actual soaps, but I will put that in my bathroom in case guests would like to use it. It does smell nice though. I like a shower gel in that smell. Super play. On the top here, rather enticingly, is this bath bomb. I presume it's a bath bomb. This is the Floating Flower Bath Bomb Essential Jasmine Bath with beautiful colours with that seep through the water. Oh my god. This wins for smell. Whatever else is in this box is not going to top this. This, to me, is the quintessential smell of Lush. You know when you walk into Lush and you get that smell, you're like, oh, I'm in the mothership. I feel so good. This, this is the smell. I'm so looking forward to using this. I want to know what colour it turns to water because sometimes it's a surprise. This looks like it's going to go violet, but maybe not. I will Instagram it for you. Oh, okay, okay. Don't sniff it too close. Just <laughs> topped it for you. Next up, we're gonna go for this. Looks like a bubble bar. Looks like two bubble bars sandwiched together in a heart shape with glitter in the middle, a glitter sandwich. I'm obviously down with that. This is the Heartthrob Bubble Rune. I presume that's still a bubble bar. You know what a bubble bar is? It's like you break a little bit off and crumble it under running water and it makes bubbles in your bath. So I presume that's what it is. It says, all the romance of a French patisseries in a passionate red sheer butter sandwich. What is next in the box? Boo 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 boo. <laughs> Does anyone know what that's from? This is the Kiss Lip Scrub. Buff your lips to pouting perfection with this bubblegum pink caster sugar scrub. So I think this is just a repackage of the old one which was bubblegum flavoured which I had years ago. In fact, I'm going to find the blog post and link it because you can see like the stuff I used to write like four years ago. Lol. Ooh, it's got little sprinkles in it. Hundreds and thousands, please, thank you. This is essentially just sugar and like some sort of oil and hundreds of thousands and what you do with it is take a little bit out, exfoliate your lips with it and then rinse off but I never finished my one off when I had one years ago because it just was so like messy to use I found and also my lips don't really need a lot of exfoliating because my lips are just f 
fine, really. They're just kissable and ready. This is a product that I've seen on so many people's Instagrams and I have just been loving it. It is the Unicorn Horn Bubble Bar. Look at it, will you please? It reminds me of so much of the Candy Mountain and you would not believe how many gifts I've seen of me going, I want to sniff my Candy Mountain all day. That smells great. I want to sniff my Unicorn Horn all day. That smells so great. Yes, you do. Just go into a shop and just smell this. I mean, buy it maybe, but smell it. It's iridescent, it's got little stars in it, it has all the colours of a Care Bears party. I just, I just, I just, <laughs> binary, 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 I just really like this a lot. What does he have to say about you? Glistening lavender and neroli scented bubbles with all the colours of the rainbow. I don't know why I've gone mad. <laughs> it really pleases me. And now I'm thinking of all the times I've said sniff my candy mountain. Yeah, that smells great. I think I've smelt too much. Hang on, a little bit do lally. Great box, good job, Lush. You always do such a good job at your limited edition stuff. I absolutely love it. I hope you've enjoyed that too and enjoyed how beautiful this box is. Don't forget to check on my second channel, which is youtube.com forward slash sprinkle of chatter, like glitter, but chatter, um, because I've been uploading vlogs onto there and I'm really happy with them, they're quite fun. And also on my blog, which is linked below for lots of articles and stuff like that, which you might enjoy that I write. And I will see you next week for something travel related, I think. Alrighty, thanks for watching. Bye.